Hello guys, welcome back to another video. Today OnePlus is rolling out a new update for OnePlus Nord users. This is again based on Android 11 and it's for beta users. If you guys are already running open beta on your device, then you should receive it via OTA update. And if you're still running Android 10, which is Oxygen OS 10, then you need to manually install it on your device. So here you can see this is my OnePlus Nord on which I have received the OTA update. The update size is 195 MB. If you guys haven't received the update, you can find the download links in the description below. Later place the file inside the internal storage of your device and make sure to place it inside the root directory of your internal storage instead of placing it inside any of the folders. Once you are done with that you just need to go to settings, system, system update, later tap on this gear icon towards the right top corner, select local upgrade and you should have the file which you have placed inside the internal storage. Just select that file, your device will automatically install Android 11 or Oxygen OS Open Beta 3 on your device. I have already installed this update, let me show you the software information first by going to settings, about section, here you can see Oxygen OS Open Beta 3 which is based on Android 11 and with this update we have also got the 1st Jan 2021 security patch and build number is 29 Jan 2021. Basically this update doesn't bring any kind of new features. There are lots of improvements done to Android 11 which are based on system, camera, ambient display and clock. And if you guys are facing any kind of issues on the previous build which is Oxygen OS Open Beta 2 then do let me know in the comment section below so that I can cover them in a review video. Basically this is one of the best Android 11 update for OnePlus Nord users because I've personally felt lots of improvements done related to UI and now I don't even see any kind of lags or jitter while using recent panel which I personally used to face on the previous build. On the previous update camera version was 6.0.91 but on this update camera version have been slightly updated and which is now 6.0.113. Under the first change log which is related to system there they have done slight optimizations related to work-life balance. Basically, I'd never use this work-life balance feature on my OnePlus devices. If you guys use this work-life balance on your OnePlus devices and if you are facing any kind of issues, then do let me know in the comment section below. After that, OnePlus have also fixed this dial pad overlapping on lock screen. This issue is also present on Oxygen OS Open Beta 1 for OnePlus 7 series. But for OnePlus Nord users, OnePlus have fixed this issue. And last fix under system is related to dark mode, wherein people had reported white space in between notification panel and the quick setting panel. And that white space is no more to be seen on Oxygen OS Open Beta 3. After that, we have two fixes which are related to camera, in which few users reported that quick gestures were not working when they had to open camera. I personally never noticed that issue on my device. But yes, on this update, OnePlus have done the fixes and now you can easily access camera with quick gestures. And after that OnePlus have also done few fixes related to front camera video recording wherein people were not able to play the video recorded through front camera. But on this build I don't find any kind of issues here. As you can see I recorded the video with front camera and I don't have any kind of issues playing that. And in a review video, we'll include the samples so that we can get a better idea whether there are improvements done related to camera or not. And we had lots of issues related to canvas, but I personally never faced this issue on my OnePlus Nord. Canvas feature just works great as usual on my OnePlus Nord. You guys let me know in the comment section below whether you are still facing the issue of canvas after upgrading to Beta 3. And at last we haven't fixed related to clock in which setting up alarm was an issue but as you can see I've been using this device as my primary device and I've already set few alarms until now I did not face any kind of issues related to setting up of alarm for users who are facing these issues hopefully that will be solved after this update so guys these were the change logs of oxygen os open beta 3 for oneplus nord now let's talk about the benchmark results so these are the benchmark results on beta 3 single core have scored 600 and multi core have scored 1802 Beta 2 scores were slightly low in which single core scored 596 and multi core scored 1788. And these are the scores with Antutu benchmark application in which device have scored 3,8542. On the previous update which was open beta 2, on that device had scored 2,72,379. So again higher benchmark results to be seen and as I said earlier there are lots of improvements done related to performance part. You won't notice any kind of lags or jitters while using the device. Now performance of Android 11 on OnePlus Nord is perfectly fine. But still you guys let me know in the comment section below if you face any kind of issues after upgrading your device to Oxygen OS Open Beta 3. As of now only this much in this video. Hope you guys like the video. If you like the video then do give me a thumbs up. 
Also, if you are new to our channel, then do not forget to subscribe the channel. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.